It's Christmas Day! Not really. It's March. If you didn't know that. I just got a package from Amazon. Let's get this out of the way. It's freaking gigantic. How's it going guys? My name is Ryan Topher and welcome to a product review. Lately I've been thinking about ways that I can improve my videos and I've also been having some audio issues. So I decided to drop a couple hundred dollars on the Audio-Technica AT2035 cardioid condenser microphone bundle with Scarlett USB audio interface, universal pop filter microphone, windscreen, and six foot Premiere series XLR male-female cable. That was a mouthful. Threw it again because the first time it didn't go that far. So without further ado, and so that you can stop listening to this horrible audio, let's rip into these equipment presents, shall we? Here it is. What the hell is this? A light that's plugged into my wall? Come on, Amazon! I did not order this! Actually, this might have been in my shopping cart on accident, so... Oh my god. There's bubble wrap. Oh! So right off the bat, I really like that this is actually a bundle. In the title on the Amazon page, it says bundle. Will you look at this thing? This is kind of tightly wrapped. I don't know who started cutting this with scissors. Definitely not me. I know I already told you guys what's in the bundle, but let me just tell you again so you can see really quick. The Scarlett 2i2 USB interface, the universal pop filter, it's gigantic by the way, and the six foot XLR cable. Now let's see how this mic sounds compared to my crappy audio right here. This is the audio from my crappy microphone. And this is the audio from the condenser mic. As you can tell, I sound like a damn pop star. Okay, maybe not like a pop star, but my voice does sound really clear. Firstly, I'd like to apologize for that monstrosity of a microphone that I used in the beginning of this video. If you're still here with me right now, I thank you. And now I know what you're thinking. Why am I using this janky little microphone arm right here? I mean, look at this thing, look at this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it up so that I don't have to hold it. You see that? That's just wrong right there. Now, the reason that I'm using this in this video is because in the next video, I'm going to be reviewing this. In that video, I'll be telling you why I bought that mic stand rather than any other mic stand. And if you want to see that video, it'll be right here. That's right, video magic. Okay, now back to the review. I want to say that this microphone has amazing quality without any EQ. What you're hearing right now is the unedited audio from this microphone, so it sounds pretty good already. All right, on to the pros and cons. <laughs> Now, like the AT2020, the AT2035 has a fixed cardioid pattern. Now, I'm no audio microphone expert, so I'm not gonna go into depth about the nitty gritty details about this microphone, but what I do know is that the fixed cardioid pattern means that it has the most sensitivity in the front and the least sensitivity in the back. It also isolates unwanted ambient noise, and it's much more resistant to feedback than a regular omnidirectional microphone. The large diaphragm part of the title of this microphone mostly just means that this microphone is more sensitive. Now what's also nice about this microphone is it comes with a custom shock mount so that you don't have to go looking for a shock mount that's going to fit this microphone. Now what the AT2035 has that the AT2020 lacked is a switchable 80 hertz high pass filter and a negative 10 decibels switch. Now the best part about this whole purchase is that it's a bundle and it actually has everything that a YouTuber like myself would need. Now as you can see it comes with a lot of stuff and it saves you about $50 if you're trying to buy all this stuff separately. The two input audio interface is highly recommended. Jacksepticeye has it. A lot of other YouTubers have this. Moving on. I hate this arm. I want to switch so bad to that new one I bought. That's in the next video. <laughs> now, let's talk about the cons of this bundle. The downsides, the negativos. That's not a word that's, that is not Spanish. It does come with a pop filter, which is great and everything, but I personally did not want a circular pop filter like this one. What I did want was this baby, so that I don't have to like readjust this thing with how close it is if I move. So it would have been nice if in this bundle there was no pop filter for me personally, but you might like this. It's a good pop filter, it's just not for me. Next con, the shock mount is made of plastic, which is all right, but everywhere that I read about this microphone, in the description it always says, the shock mount is made of high quality plastic. But plastic 
is plastic. Am I right, fellas? But really, it'd be nice if the shock mount was made out of some better materials. I don't know what, because I'm not a shock mount manufacturer, but that's just my personal opinion. The verdict. To me, the pros outweigh the cons. The cons are honestly super minor nitpicks, and this microphone has amazing quality, as you can see. As you can hear. I don't know, all right? You can see sound, you're maybe a special human being. This bundle overall saved me a lot of money, and I'm honestly really glad that I bought it. No regrets. So, thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, subscribe. I post gameplays and all that shit. You know, <laughs> you don't care. If you want to see me review these things, just click on the videos that are around the screen. And I will see you guys in the next video. Shit.